You, you want to watch Mythbusters? This is like a really bad date. At least we're not in school. That's a horrible comeback for that. What are you going to do when you're 25 and working at Outback Steakhouse? Well, at least we're not in school. I would never fucking work at Steakback Outhouse. That doesn't change the fact we're stuck here without gas money and your mom only pays for the basic cable package. So you don't want to watch Mythbusters? We literally just left school to avoid men who go, This is true. Why the fuck would I watch a show about them? I heard every other episode they accidentally show you a new way to make crystal meth. Did they ever do one on cigarettes causing cancer? If cigarettes were in Star Wars, then maybe. Can I smoke in here? You can. I don't know if you should. My mom might get mad. Okay, well, you hate your mom. And your brother. And anyone else you mentioned to me. So just let me smoke in here. Holy shit, calm down. You've only been smoking for like a year. How are you addicted? Have an alternative? My mom has a bunch of old prescriptions in her medicine cabinet. You want to crush them up and see what they do to us? Wow, snorting your mom's pills. We'd be like the guy in Scarface if he ran a nursing home. This might be a stupid question, but what even is Scarface? It's like a drug dealer movie. I don't know, the ESL kids won't stop wearing shirts of it. I think they did a Mythbusters on Scarface. That sounds so awesome for a guy who wears cargo shorts. What are we doing, Nicole? And don't say sobriety. I think the pills could be a lot more fun than you're expecting. How's that? My mom has problems, dude. And she's old, so the doctor just writes her whatever she wants. What, are we gonna snort polio meds? Don't they have a vaccine for that? Not when she was born. Look, she goes to a new psychiatrist after every divorce, and they keep giving her the good shit because she doesn't move over the medical history. Oh, that's a nice strategy. My mom only gets the daily Prozac shit after they cut her off from Valium. She should get divorced. New health plan, new psychiatrist. My mom hasn't worked in like 20 years. I don't know if she could even function without my dad. Can't she just find a new guy? My mom does. You haven't seen my mom, Nicole. She stopped trying like 10 years ago. I don't think you can ever come back from that. Yeah, after the mom genes, it's just over. Tragic. Thanks, now I have to think about how sad my mom is. This is why I'll never get married. This is why we should do those pills now. Come on. Why does it hit so fast when you start it? Fuck. Doesn't Vicodin always hit like that? I never tried it. No, it takes like an hour when you take it like a pill. Wow. Prescriptions are just dope on layaway. A line of it does a little at first, but then just creeps up fast. Here, try it. Oh my god, I'm scared. Is my nose gonna bleed? Only if you do it like a million times. (laughs) What the fuck? How does your mom function like this? She doesn't. What if she needs these later? It's easy to get more. She can make an appointment and pay like two bucks for a whole bottle. They won't cut her off or anything? Yeah, that's the one perk to being old. If you want enough drugs to shut off your emotions, they won't assume you'll try to OD or anything. Yeah, they said that when I wanted sleeping pills. It's so bullshit. Like, even if you wanted to do that, it's like... Like... Like, none of their business shit it's really hitting now. Oh yeah, I feel it too. It's like Percocet, but not as good. You can say that about any painkiller. You want to watch Mythbusters now? I am nowhere near fucked up enough to watch Mythbusters. We might have something left to fix that. Why the fuck do you want to watch Mythbusters so bad? Uh, I don't know. It's the only thing on when I skip. Uh, Okay, give me something good. You want to try a mystery pill? I'm not even looking at the label, but I'll crush it up. Mystery pill? What if it hurts me? Dude, you're viked up. You're good. All right, fuck it. Line it up. (laughs) Is it good? Oh my god. Oh my god. What did I do? I don't feel anything. Really? She always has the strongest shit. What if it's just a Claritin or something? No, my mom barely has allergies. Let me read the label. Metroprolol. Generic for beta-lock. Beta-lock? It should say what it's for, right? It says, use for high blood pressure or tightness of chest. Let yeah, me do a line of beta blocker. Oh god, it's hitting. There's a name for it? How'd you know that? A chemistry teacher told us about it last year. Miss that class. That was the last pill, too. My mom must take a lot of these. I'm like deflating in my own body. How long up does your mom to always need these? We don't really talk about that. She just comes home and yells at me. I would yell at you, too. Why the fuck didn't you tell me it was a beta blocker? I think you're missing the point of a mystery pill. I took it with Vicodin, Nicole. Call 911. Dude, you're going to be fine. Worst case scenario, you pass out. Why do I feel like a guy's told me that before? Ugh, chest pains. One pill left. Just got to get up these stairs. The women at Ross are so goddamn difficult. Damn, Jekka, you're out cold. Nicole, why are you home? And why is all my medicine on the floor? Oh, shit. Hey, Mom. Um... We were feeling sick, so we took a bunch of your pills. I don't have time for excuses. Just where's my beta lock? Beta lock? Um, what do you need that for? I feel like I'm having a heart attack. Why is the bottle empty? My fucking god. Uh, Jekka was having a heart attack too. Oh god. 
Everything's getting dark. Call 911. Okay, Mom. Mom? Oh. What the fuck? Mom? Fuck, where's the phone? So, how was the funeral? When as expected. Meaning? My aunt pulled out a gun. 